It was around midnight. I was in my usual confused state. Nothing was working. Not the riding, the women, the horses. Not the jobs, the no jobs, the weather. Not even my dick. Finally, you just sit there in a stricken state and wait. Like you're at the bus stop. Only you're waiting for death. Got your water? Jesus Christ. I got them on eBay, about 5,000 apiece. They were FedEx from a lab in North Korea. You cunt! I told you I don't love you. I just want you to suck it! Marty, please, don't talk to me that way. It's so crude, so humiliating. He doesn't love you, Sarah. Can't you see that? He doesn't need a blowjob. He needs a fucking restraining order. They started a little menage a trois a few days after they arrived. And since then, things have been going downhill. Kind of sad, isn't it? I mean, I like to watch, but... Being a voyeur is better than getting hurt. Anyway, I get awfully hot when they make love. <laughs> no shit. Marty stays submerged longer than a sailor on a doomed Russian sub. <laughs> but Albert, he's a little square. We watched them do their thing, and pretty soon I was getting hot myself. I wondered if interacting with the dolls was legal in California. That tiny little bitch started looking good to me. But my tongue alone probably would have killed her. You bitch! Don't you ever talk while I'm lining up a shop! I'm sorry, Tano. I didn't mean it. You're gonna suck it tonight. And you're gonna do my friends, too! Maybe she was right. Maybe she had a good thing after all. <laughs>